President Maduro stood in front of a galvanized government pledging to launch Venezuelan oil and mine development in the oil-rich region of Essequibo and asking Guyanese companies to withdraw their operations from the area. He also suggested a bill be sent to the National Assembly for the creation of Guyana Essequibo, a new state in the region. Let's immediately proceed with the granting of operating licenses for the exploration and exploitation of oil, gas and mines in the entire area of our Guyana Essequiba. Under the special law, I propose to give all Guyanese companies three months to withdraw from their operations in the sea. Three months. This comes after Caracas's referendum on Sunday, where according to officials it had a 50% voter turnout, of which 95% of voters were in favour of claiming sovereignty over the region. The 160,000 square kilometre region has been a disputed territory between Venezuela and Guyana for over a century. But Venezuela's interest in the area peaked after the discovery of offshore oil and gas in 2015. Essequibo makes up two-thirds of neighbouring Guyana, which produces 400,000 barrels of oil and gas per day. In a statement on Tuesday, Guyanese president denounced Maduro's actions. This is a direct threat to Guyana's territorial integrity, sovereignty and political independence. Guyana warned Venezuela that it would turn to the UN Security Council for help should any further moves be made.